Uh, today we're reviewing the cafeteria. Uh, out of five stars, what would you give it? Give it uh, three stars. Water. They provide good breakfast, but not very good lunch. All right, everyone, today we're here with? This is Clausen. All right, Ms. Clausen, so um, we're gonna ask you a question today. If you were to give anything in this school a Yelp review out of five stars, anything at all, what would you give that? I'd obviously rate the English department five out of five stars. That's a good, that's a good answer. I can give the same too. Thank you, Ms. Clausen, no for being with us today. Of course. All right, thank you. All right, hello, everyone, I'm here with Mr. Cross. All right, Mr. Cross, so we're going to ask you one question. It's very, very broad, so the question is, if you could Yelp review something in this tool on a five stars, anything you want at all, what would you give it and what is it? Uh, I would give the Drama Theater Club a five star review. I think the performances that they put on a Broadway level, uh, they give a lot of energy, the costumes, the set design, the delivery by the actors and actresses, I think it's definitely a five star performance to give. All right, thank you very much, Mr. Cross. I would agree with that as well. Thank you. All right, everyone, so I'm here with today Dylan. All right, hello, Dylan. How are we doing today, man? Good, how are you? Good, all right. So I got one question for you. It's pretty broad. I'm just going to ask you. So if you were to Yelp review something in the school out of five stars, anything you want, tell us what that thing would be and how many out of five stars would you give it? Um, if I were to rate the food, I'd give it a five because it was pretty good. All right, well, thank you very much for being here. Hope you have a great day. You too. Oh, uh, hello everyone. My name is Mike Green, and we're here with Kmar. All right, Cam. So I'm gonna ask a question today. So the question is being, if you were to yell for me this week, whether it be anything at all, like you know, like the food or a specific department, like English history. What department would you, you know, rate and what out of five stars would you give it? Um, I rate the English department like two or three out of five stars. Why would that be to him? Uh, just because I don't really like the way that we get graded in class. That's very, that's very true, Kim. Yeah, thank you very much for your grade. You have a great day. All right, I'm David, and I'm here to ask Sean Morrison about <laughs> a Yelp review about the school. So if you had, if you had to give a Yelp review about any part of the school, at one out of five, what would you give it? All right, so I'm going to focus on the athletics of the school. I think they have really good athletics. Uh, we've got a good fan base here. Uh, got to get involved, you know, come support us, you know, track team, just like any. All right, hello, everyone. My name is Mike Green, and I'm here with... Miss Richardson of the English Department. Uh, how are we doing, Miss Richardson of the English Department? I'm doing well. How are you? I'm good, thank you. So I have a, a question for you today. It's a little broad question. Um, so it's about a Yelp review. If you were to Yelp a department, anything in the school, and give it out of five stars, what would that department or thing be, and what would you give it out of five stars? Um, I would Yelp um, the Playwriting Club. It's I think it's five stars. Um, it's a little self-promoting, I'm the advisor, but I don't think a lot of people know about it. And we have students who come on Wednesday nights and we just create art and they write their own plays. And what they end up doing is put on and act and direct their own plays at RMHS. And we're hoping to get a bigger crowd this year. Um, if they're really funny, some of them are more dramatic. There, but there's a lot of comedies this year um, and it's, it's a fun, free activity on Friday, April 5th. And then the other thing that's really awesome that the students do, they have the opportunity to submit their plays to Boston University, and the artistic director of the Boston Playwrights Theater um, chooses two from RMHS to put on stage with equity actors and equity directors. So it's a really big deal, and they can put it on their college applications and see their plays live on stage in front of um, other schools, and it's biggest blast. So what day of the week does this happen? Um, we meet on Wednesday nights and it's not a big time commitment. We start the first Wednesday after Christmas break or winter break I should say and we go for about like 12 weeks and we just meet on Wednesday nights. Um, we have a playwright who's um, a working playwright in the Boston area come in twice and he or she gives us their advice 
and helps us write the plays and the students can email him or her with um, you know questions about their play and they get like professional feedback so it's very low-key it's not a grade we just sit we create art we talk about um, writing and create it's so fun Oh, well, thank you very much, Richard. Ms. Richardson. And so if you guys like playwriting, let Ms. Richardson know. She'd be happy to help you with whatever you'd like. Join their club Wednesday nights, again, after Christmas break. Thank you very much. Have a great Thanks, day. Thanks, Mike. You too. Thank you.